Hey guys, this is Kay from Asian Boss. Recently, Snapchat was involved in a controversy when the CEO of Snapchat allegedly said that the app was only for rich people and that they didn't want to expand into poor countries like India and Spain. Snapchat has since denied this allegation, but apparently this caused a lot of public anger in India. But how angry are they? Up until now, you probably never had a chance to hear it directly from the people of India. So we're gonna go to an Asian Boss correspondent in India, Sheetal. Sheetal, take it away. Hey guys, this is Sheetal coming to you from Vidyanagar, India. And today we're going to ask Indian people about what they think about this Snapchat controversy. Let's go. So not a long time ago, the CEO of Snapchat allegedly said that it wasn't worth expanding Snapchat services to India because it was too poor. What do you think about this? Have you heard this? Okay, so uh, what's your reaction to this? I think uh, after that, uh, most of the Indians have uh, deleted the Snapchat. You know. In the position of CEO, he should not uh, term the India country as poor country. Okay. It's his and, uh, loss. It's not acceptable. It's his loss. Well, I did not inst uninstall Snapchat at the first place. It is quite a good app, to be honest. And uh, he might think that India may not give him that kind of huge profit with the other countries give. I don't think there's uh, anything to get offended about it because India does have a low GDP uh, compared to them. What's your reaction to this? I think he get the answer in his reviews only. If we see the app reviews right now, it's only one star. He should once visit India and should enjoy the lavishness of the country and then we should think about, rethink about what he spoke about us. And do you use Snapchat? No, I don't use Snapchat and even I want Indians to stop using Snapchat even for a day so that he can understand the loss incurred. Uh, actually, uh, this could be a bit controversial, no offense, but uh, it was his point of view as a businessman. He, he right. must have studied with the reports that uh, mm. it's it's not working out with the India. So mm. so he must have used that statement and he did not use that it's a poor country. He said that the GDP is below this much and it's true. He, he did not say anything wrong. What uh, young people reacted to this? Uh, it was very foolish uh, reac reaction. Like they uninstalled the app. Yeah. So <laughs> that, that was like really foolish deed. I mean, there is no need of uninstalling the app. If you like this, you use it. People even who don't know the GDP of their own country, yeah. they, they are just uh, getting emotional and getting uh, uninstalling the app. So that is really foolish reaction. I mean, I'm not uh, opposing our, my own people. But actually, the, that shouldn't be done. From my point of view, it was actually a business technique. Okay. Uh, Snapchat was not that much grown in India. It's not that hit like WhatsApp. So I guess okay. it was a business point of view. Okay. And what do you think how people in India uh, reacted to this? They were a bit angry. If, even I was one of them. <laughs> okay. Like you should not say like that, but still. Uh, you did say it, it was from a business perspective. Uh, yeah, it was from right. a business point of view. Because after that... The number of views in this Snapchat, even on uh, App Store, had increased tremendously from okay. India. Yeah. So it was one of the plus points that Snapchat is getting <laughs> advertised everywhere. But why do you think he said that? I think he thinks India is a very poor country, that's why. And, wha and what's your answer to that? Uh, India is not Most a poor, poor country. country. So you were offended by what he said? Yes. Okay. I am living in a place where there is a land of opportunities and you are yeah, telling me it's a poor country. if someone just comes up and just say that our country is poor, then we are not going like, to be quiet. Uh, do you agree that there might be parts where in Indians have poor people and poor uh, slums and areas? Yes, there are in many areas. In every country areas. there are areas. Yeah. yeah, but overall, if we compare it to before, then I think that India has improved a lot. How do you think Americans view India as a country? First of all, Americans view India as poor. Yeah. Because uh, they think that we still set back in the 19th century before but independence. But is that true? Obviously not. Okay. Because uh, if you check out, out of the world billionaires, 13 billionaires are from India. But even then, there is, there is this corruption thing going on in India and all that stuff, which makes a mindset in mindset for the people that yeah India is poor because you, uh, your people of you find people of every class like right. there are this 
beggars but india uh, they might have areas that they are there are poor people yeah, and slums do. but there are also rich people exactly there yeah. are also rich people but they fail to notice the rich and they notice the poor so that's the difference so that was really insightful and i really enjoyed listening to different people's perspectives hope you guys did too back to you kay thanks shetel we want to bring you the most authentic perspectives on the latest news and cultural trends from asia so if you're from asia and you think you can do what shetel has done on your mobile phone like this get in touch with us at askasianboss@gmail.com. at gmail.com thanks for watching everybody i'm kay from asian boss see you next time